Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Oregon Trail. I'm attacking two cans and right now we're heading to Las Vegas. I want to go to Las Vegas so bad when I turn 21, I think that'd be so much fun. Except I'm not going to gamble because I have really terrible luck. Miley tells an inspiring story and puts everyone in high spirits. <gasps> Was it about a wrecking ball? I hope so. Oh my god, I just remembered Donna's dead. I'm so sad. Broken down car blocks the road. Oh, cars. <laughs> Navigating the debris takes an hour. Jeez. Just to go around some broken down cars or be like on a really steep mountain path or something? You stop suddenly to avoid hitting a zombie and everyone gets whiplash. Darn it. So I haven't played this game in quite a long time because I went down to Texas and I recorded the last three episodes before I went down to Texas. Now it's been like a few days since I've gotten back and now I'm recording again, so I can't really remember what's happening. You found an abandoned car, but there was nothing inside. Oh, so sad. And I remember when I started this little let's play, I thought it was going to be like a three episode video series. Nah, episode seven now. Just going on strong. Fuck you, thief. I like my ammo. You can't just steal it from me, bitch head. Okay, how far are we now? We have 107 miles left to go. You see a tombstone nearby. Yes, I would love to investigate it. What's it gonna say? Spody Odie, the mystery, the myth. Oh no, he's alive! Shit! Uh, kill the fucker! <sighs> hey, at least we have a decent amount of ammo left still. I mean, I buy all the ammo I possibly can, so I guess it's well expected to have quite a bit. Miley has a fever. It's probably because she smoked too much weed. Damn it, Miley. I know nothing about weed. I'm just saying all these things. You find some roadkill, it's probably safe to eat. Yeah, you know, probably. You never know. Okay, first off, zombie activity is high, so sad. I guess we could go ahead and rest for a tiny bit so we can real heal all of our healths. <gasps> Lucas dysentery went away. Okay, we're done resting. Let's talk to a stranger. I've seen this plague spread through bites, but what about all those empty graves out there? I don't think they were bit. Just what are we dealing with here? A bitch. Okay, zombie activity is medium, so I'm gonna go scavenging for some shit. All right, I got 100 food, five dollars, and five scrap. I wanna check the store, actually, nope, more scavenging. All right, 270 food and 40 dollars, nice. Okay, it's still low, I'm gonna go ahead and go to the shop real fast. Is there any ammo I can buy? Buy ammo, 100 in stock, I'm gonna buy as much as possible. Um, how much am I buying? I am buying 100 bullets, worth it. Um, do I need to buy anything else? I'm pretty sure I'm doing pretty good. What jobs are available? Ooh, recovery for $48. Somebody told me not to even shoot zombies behind me whatsoever, just to run forward and shoot anything directly in front of me. Because I can not waste very much ammo and get through this really fast with hardly anything gone. Okay, so I'm just gonna run because I'm faster than all of you bitches. And you will suck balls. Yeah, all of you. That's how you guys all got this job. It's from a really bad... STD of some sort, and that's how you guys all turn into zombies. Every single one of you is super sexually active. Now me, on the other hand, I'm not sexually active at all, so I'm fine. <laughs> I mean, I might be lying. Or am I? Am I sexually active? You'll never know. Unless you see my porno, then you probably will know. Jeez, I wasted like three bullets, and that's it. And I got $48. So worth it. Um, Eight more dollars for an easy recovery? Let's do it. I only wasted two bullets and I got eight dollars. I think that's worth it as well. What trades are there? A passerby wants 20 of your dollars for one of their med kits. How many med kits? Nah, girl, nah. A passerby wants two of your fuel for one of their mufflers. Oh, hell yes, we need a muffler really bad. Passerby wants 55 of our food for two of their fuel. Um, yeah. So we pretty much we bought a muffler for 55 food. That is perfect. And zombie activity is so low, so more scavenging. Okay, $70, 100 food, and 15 scrap. That is amazing. Do I need to fix my car at all? Yeah, let's go ahead and do that as well. Why not? We have 114 scrap, so we can. All right, we successfully repaired. And as you guys probably noticed, I've been cutting out as much as possible just because of the fact that I really want to get through this game as quick as possible just because it's getting kind of monotonous and repetitive. And so I'm just cutting out all the super monotonous, repetitive stuff for you guys so you don't have to sit through it all because I know that can be kind of annoying at times. 135 ounces of food and 20 scrap. Nice. Do I want to keep doing this? Jeez. I know people told me that during the nighttime it's usually low activity. Or is that during the daytime it's low activity? I can't remember. What do I want to do next? I guess you might as well just leave this town because 
I think we're pretty much done here. We've gotten a lot finished. I'm gonna use a med kit on myself just because I'm starting to get kind of down on health. Is there any jobs left? Nope, okay. Let's make progress. Let's keep driving. So what's our next stop? Does it tell me? I'm not sure, I didn't really look at it. 277 miles left, we'll be there in no time anyways. Miley no longer has a fever. Good job, Miley. I know you could get through this, cause I adore you. Yes, uh, have you guys seen um, Super Fruits? Oh, you see the remains of another party before you. Would you like to stop and look? Yes, I would love to. Brains, brains. Oh, how I relish your tender fruit. Ah! Alive! Oh shit, gotta hit his head. Oh shit. Boom! Oh, that was close. Ah, ah, ah. Is he dead? What did I get? Did I get anything? Nothing? That wasn't worth it. So dumb. I should have at least gotten like five food or something. Oh well, we're still doing super good. What is this? You think you see something going on in the distance? Yes, I'm gonna go investigate because I'm nosy. When you get out of the car, you hear a scuffle on the other side. You see Miley struggling with someone. By the time you make it around to the other side, they are already holding a gun to Miley's head. What's their life worth to you? Offer 100 food, $100, or 100 ammo? Drag to see more. How do I drag? Oh, take the shot. 100 food? You make the trade and get Miley back safely. Ugh. Probably wasn't really worth it, but you know, keep as many people alive alive keep as many people alive as long as possible the mine I've been working on the railroad all the live long day a defense eh, nah I'm not gonna do it what um, stuff can we buy what can we trade first if I love the trades um, four of their fuel for one of our med kits nah girl nah um, 45 of their food for one of our tires yeah nah girl nah never might as well repair the car while we're here. Successful repair. Now I'm going to... I don't think there's anything else we really want to do here. I guess buy any food. I don't need any of these. Um, combat trainer. Dude, what is this? Find more money than anything else while scavenging for 80 bucks. That might actually be good. I think that'd be better than... Oh, shit. Okay, that's the one I wanted to get rid of. Thank God I clicked on that one instead of one of the other ones. Okay, nice. Now we're going to definitely be rolling in the dough. You might as well leave because the activity is deadly, so there's nothing much we can really do anymore. And I want to go to Salt Lake City. I've actually been there last year, or I guess two years ago, because Donna didn't go to PAX last year. Jeez, time passes by so quickly. Um, but me and Donna had a... Oh, fuck! My muffler! I just bought that! For 55 food, so not for much, but I only have one of those and two of the other things, so I'd like to keep the one I'd have one of. You catch a bandit trying to steal gas cans, but the carrier is locked tight. But yes, me and Donna were stuck at um, Salt Lake City in the airport for like three hours on a transfer flight. It was kind of fun. I enjoyed it. Oh, I miss Donna. I just saw her last week and I already miss her again. Um, you see the grave of some poor soul buried. Guess I'll take a look. Who is it this time? Innocence, virtue, truth, justice. You're alive! Ah! I better get something this time because I'm tired of not getting anything from doing this. God, that's terrifying. I'm so bad at these two-dimensional shootings. Okay, I'm not doing those anymore because I never get anything for them. Damn it. Okay, we're in Salt Lake City. Auto shop? Ooh, buy a muffler? Yes, $78. I can't afford it. Damn it, I can't believe he sold my muffler for that much. Ugh, it's so expensive. I don't like it. Um, activity is high, so we probably shouldn't do that yet. I'm gonna go ahead and rest for a couple hours to refill our life. Okay, our life is full. What jobs are there? Oh my gosh. Oh, that's not good. 99 food. Nah, girl, nah. I guess it's like 40 bucks though. That might actually be pretty good. <gasps> two mufflers? Fuck yes. I would love to. That's like a 140 buck payment right there. But it's dangerous, but it's not deadly, so I can definitely do this. And then I'm using the trick that you guys told me to draw like a line from myself to the zombies, or from the zombies to me. And it's a lot easier to shoot them, I guess. I mean, for the most part, I mean, I'm doing kind of bad regardless, but I am pretty bad at this game. And I think we're pretty much good. Oh, it's two of these guys. Two of the double hitters. I hate the double hitters. Okay, there we go. We got two mufflers. That was so worth it. Awesome. What time is it? Uh, still high. Do I want to fix my car? I guess I can do that real fast. Okay, I think I'm going to buy some more ammo because I can never have too much ammo. It's always good to have that shit. And medium. I'm going to scavenge real fast. I'm going to see how much money I get. 
I actually got four items this time. I got two wallets, which is pretty handy dandy. Forty dollars, twenty scrap, and a hundred food. Definitely worth it. I could probably actually. Is there any trades available? Yes. Um, twenty-seven of their food for twenty-six of your dollars. Oh no. Hell no. Um, someone who will spare one of their tires for twenty-two of your dollars. We already have enough tires, so no. Um, two of their scrap for one of your mufflers. No, these are some awful trades. No thanks. Um. I don't want to scavenge anymore. I think we're doing pretty good, actually. Combat training. Okay, there's nothing available there. Um, upgrades. Nothing available. And I think we are good to leave this location. So I think it is time to head out. Anything else we want to buy? $71. Let's look at our supply real fast. I think we're doing good on everything. I might want to buy one more med kit if they have one. Yeah, I'm going to buy one more of these because I want to have two just in case. Okay, let's leave this town. What is next? You must cross a horde of zombies to continue. Yeah, I can do that. Oh, this is gonna be easy. Um, attempt to sneak through. We're good. We're good, girls. And boys. <laughs> There's some boys watching this, I'm sure, but mostly girls watch my videos, I'm pretty sure. I mean, only girls watch gaming videos nowadays. Yay, we made it through. So where are we going? 570 miles to the airbase. Let's start flying to the airbase. Except our car can't fly because it doesn't have wings. But if it did have wings, we would totally fly to the airbase. You try to drive through a flooded street. It doesn't work. Aw, so sad. Zombie activity is low. We're doing actually pretty good this run. You slow down to sneak past a large horde of zombies. Okay, that's fine with me. With me! Um, I'm so weird. Found some wild fruit. More food for us. Everyone's health is looking good. Knock on wood. That rhymes. Luca was bitten by a zombie. No! Luca! Bad Luca! He'll make it through. We're almost there, Luca. Just stay with us. Um, have you fall girls in? I'm pretty sure if someone gets bitten, you can still make them to the you can still get them to the very end of the game alive, and then they'll like re help them out there. I'm pretty sure the more people you have at the very end of the game, there's like a like a final boss fight thing and it makes it easier if you have more people, get more ammo or something. Your battery dies. We replace it from supplies. This guy clears up. Awesome. How much further is it? We're about halfway there. This is a pretty long car ride actually. Someone is shooting at the, you in the distance. You can hear the bullet hit the car. That's scary. Did we lose some car life? Yeah, we did. Shit. I wonder what part it hit. Probably hit the car's butt. Yummy. Car butts are so hot. I just can't stop fantasizing over those car butts. Does my commentary have any actual substance with the things I say? <gasps> no, not really. But it's whatever. Airbase. The grim scenery depresses everyone. Oh, I'm sorry, everyone. Oh, the other bad part about getting bit by a zombie, it means their life goes down a lot faster. You find a fuel can at a gas station. Nice! So now we're at the air base. Okay, we should probably repair our station wagon, like usual. Okay, our car is now successfully healed. Now, let's talk to a stranger. I ran into this giant zombie fight bear thing. I kept shooting at it, but I could only slow it down. It wouldn't die. I was lucky to get out of there alive. Actually... When I play this game on the Ouya while scavenging a lot, I got attacked by those giant zombie bears, and they're actually really terrifying. Um, I'm just going to rest a lot because we have so much food, and I want everybody to be healed again, so let's go ahead and do that. Okay, everyone is now healed. Ooh, a bandit mission for three batteries? Don't mind if I do. God, there's a million of these fuckers. Okay, we already killed one. This is still insane. Regardless, oh man, I barely missed that one. This is suicide. Holy shit. Oh, oh, this is so difficult. Anyways, thank you all for watching this episode of Oregon Trail. The next episode should be the finale because I'm pretty sure that's our last stop. Um, so yeah, I'm going to end this end screen off with me fighting these bandits to see if I win the two batteries. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. It means a lot to me. And I will see you all next time. Bye.